Welcome everybody, this is the Mad Hatter.tv. This is the tutorial on how to stream games on the LiveMe.com. Have you ever been sitting there and you're like, you know what? I've seen a lot of other gamers do it, but how do I do it too? Well, check this out, guys. Part one is just that. It's how to game on the LiveMe.com. So, grab a seat, you guys. Here we go. I'm going to show you guys just how to start. Here you go. So we're going to load up our cellular telephone unit. We're grabbing our own seat. Now, we're going to load up the live.me app. Check this out. We're then going to go into the gaming section. Uh, in case you missed it, guys, up top there's a few different bars. There's shorts, girls, global, game, and talent. We're going to go over to the gaming tab. The first thing you'll notice on that gaming tab up top is the gamers incentive program let's check that out you can actually get paid to play video games on this app that's right live me will pay you to play video games so oh well there's top broadcasters on there who is that gorgeous guy up top oh my gosh it's the mad hatter guys make sure you check him out give him a follow uh, where were we let's go back let's go back all right so you can press the sign up button from there or check this out there's other tabs there's stream games download the kit so if you want to download the gaming kit and get ready guys this is what you're gonna press you're gonna press that button that'll get you into this tab from here you're gonna press sign up now they're looking for more talent so you can show it across the world you're gonna press the sign up button you're gonna give them their phone number one two three four five six seven eight nine and then you're going to press send after you've pressed send you're gonna wait a minute Doo -doo -doo. after you've wait a minute they're then going to send you a code one two three four five six and then you're gonna press OK at this point we have to play imagination land because I'm already signed up so you're gonna be like oh congratulations you put in the right code thank you so much and then you're like great now what well great question you're gonna close out the app you're gonna wait a couple seconds we're then going to reload this amazing live.me application we're then going to go into the bottom part now and you're gonna notice there's a new little button there there's this yellow but you guys see it right here this yellow button you're going to press it it's called game broadcast Wow and here we are live me is awesome yay maybe with even a golf clap and then once we're at this point guys we're ready to go live we've enabled it we're at the go live part and you're like great now let's press go live what is this what is this there's this code now there's this code well that's part two so let's jump right on into it part two how to connect liveme.com with open broadcast studios so let's jump right on into that guys so we're going to need to go to obsproject.com once you're here you're going to press the download OBS studio button and it's gonna ask you Windows 7 Mac or Linux it doesn't matter you guys whatever platform you're on that's just fine all of them will do uh, so we're gonna pretend that I downloaded it and then we're going to open it we're already running one so let's run another one I suppose alright so let's bring it on over where to go okay there it is Woo! this is how it looks brand new ignore all of these other sources we're just taking one at the brand new so to make one brand new, you're going to press this button, and you'll call it new to live me. You can call it whatever you want, guys. I just called mine new to live me. And then you're going to add uh, display capture. In my case, it's already made. It's called main. But uh, as, you'll, as you press the create button, you'll notice there's a couple displays, display one or display two. I'm going to pick this one because that's the one we want to show off. And I'll press OK. And you'll notice in this box, whoa in this box look there it is so watch this box over here guys now if we get rid of that box boop, remove it and suddenly it's gone it's like oh my gosh there goes the box there it goes you guys so that's what you're going to want to do for that one first you guys all right now after you've done this part you're then going to want to go into the up oh, let's make sure we don't show something we're not supposed to you're then going to want to press into the settings buttons perfect Yep. So you're going to want to press into the settings buttons and then you're going to want to go into the stream. And right now you'll notice it's blank. You're like, well, what the heck? 
Well, do you guys remember that very long code? Let's go back to it. Do you guys remember this very long code? You're like, oh my gosh, that long code. Yeah. What was that all about? Okay. So we're then going to grab this long code. What do you mean we're going to grab it? Well, you see how there's a little forward button? See how there's a forward button? It's like pew. So we're then going to send this off to our email. We're then going to email this to ourselves. After we've emailed it to ourselves, we're going to bloop. We're going to paste it on in there. We're going to press apply. We're going to press OK. And then, oh, well, we need our browser source back. Remember, see, look, it's a blank screen. So the audience is going to see a blank screen right now. Whatever is in this screen, that's what your audience is going to see. So you're going to want to make sure that your display capture is properly set up. So let's add. See, look, there it's back. See in that screen, now it's back. This is what the audience will see. The audience will then see whatever whatever is in this one right here. That's what the audience is going to see. All right, so at that point, we are now ready to press start on this one, and we are also ready to press start on this one, guys. So first thing you're going to do is on the OBS one, you're going to want to press start streaming, and it's going to take off. Do 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 and it's streaming guys and suddenly it's live now what about our phone though is our phone ready to go live is our phone ready let's see if we did it right if we did it right we should be going live and suddenly you're live and on the gaming Woo! congratulations